What's up, Raider Nation? What's up, YouTube? This your boy, LB, and I'm back once again with another YouTube video. In this video, I will be talking about Joe Flacco being traded to the Denver Broncos. And the reason why I'm talking about this topic is because he coming to the AFC West. He's a he's an AFC competitor, but... Now he he gonna be a, a division rival, rival. Joe Flacco being traded to the Denver Broncos for a fourth round pick. That's crazy. That's wild. So now, now that changes everything in the AFC West. That gonna change all people draft picks. That gonna change the whole division draft pick. Bad Joe. Like Joe Flacco being traded to the Denver Broncos, they're going to change Mayock and John Gruden's draft pick. Why? Because they're going to bring competition, more competition, to the AFC West. And we don't know what kind of contract Joe Flacco is going to sign. But Joe Flacco, he didn't have a good season last year. But Joe Flacco, he is a gunslinger and a mobile quarterback. He knows how to lead a team. So the Denver Broncos have faith in, uh, in Flacco. Flacco, he don't make a lot of mistakes if you surround the, the um, what's I'm going to call it? The, the um, weapons. If you surround him with good weapons and decent receivers, he's going to make things happen. He's going to make things happen. I'm not going to discredit him. Flacco is good. But now... We got to deal with Phillip Rivers, Patrick Mahomes. Did I say Patrick Mahomes? Yeah, Patrick. Patrick Mahomes. <coughs> and then Joe Flacco. Phillip Rivers, Joe Flacco, and Patrick Mahomes. Now, that is competition in the LC West. Now, the LC West is the dangerous division. You cannot take discredit the LC West. Now, the LC West is the dangerous division division. It is the toughest division. Flacco, Mahomes, Carr, Rivers. So, I will be doing another video talking about how dangerous the LC West is. I already know somebody's going to steal my topic. Whoever watched this video already knows somebody's going to steal my topic. So, there y'all go have it, but I'm going to still talk about this topic. Still, well, still talk about that topic and this topic. So, Flacco. You really can't say it because Flacco really never. Well, you can't say that because Flacco did come from another tough division. So, Flacco is going to, like, at least boost a little bit of Denver confidence. He's going to lead Denver just a little bit. He ain't, ain't going to do too much, but Denver will look a little bit better than what Keenum did. So, I don't expect Flacco to do too much, but he's going to do enough to, like, try to make a push. Try to make Denver relevant again. So, that's basically it, man. It ain't too much. Don't don't expect too much from Flacco. Don't expect him to take Broncos to the Super Bowl, because that's not going to happen. Because we know Gr Gruden and, and Carl going to do their thing this season coming up. So, I believe this by... Flacco going to Denver, it's going to change the outcome of the draft. It is what it is, but it's going to change the outcome of the draft. Because teams that need the quarterbacks can go after, can trade, can trade up. Teams can trade up now. Cardinals, 49ers, Raiders, <laughs> team might trade up for quarterback now. By Flacco going to Denver, hey, team's going to trade up. 
teams are going to trade up. And teams that's up there at the top might be a chance to get more draft picks. But you got to be, be a smart draft. You got to be smart. It has to be smart. Because the AFC is tough now. What Gruden and me y'all going to do? See me? I'm going to get some defense and weapons. I'm, we got a lot of picks in the top 100. We have a lot of picks in the top 100. So, you cannot mess up the first round. That That's just common sense. You can't mess up the first round. That's why I say in the first round, it's all defense. All defense. You cannot mess up the first round. Because you know your biggest, it's like your biggest help is defense. You, no, not biggest help. Your biggest need is defense. You need to focus on defense. They're just point blank something. Just focus on defense. So, can't mess up the first round. First round. Got three picks in the first round. Can't mess the first round up. I would go defense. Mm, that's it. Yeah, all right. Defense in. Linebacker. Corner. Because you got to get pressure. You, you, your biggest need is a middle linebacker. Just the run stopper. And you need that other shutdown corner. First round. Corner, linebacker, defense in. It don't matter which order. Just go at least get the best or the most talented. That's me. Well, all right, I'm off. Y'all let me know in the comment section. Peace. <clears throat> all right, y'all. Whoa, 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 whoa. One more thing. Raider Nation, Denver, Kansas City, Chargers, and... Everyone knows. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about Joe Flacco being traded to the AFC West. Well, being traded to the Broncos and coming to the AFC West. Y'all let me know how y'all feel in that comment section. Do y'all think it's going to be a good thing? Bad thing? Is it going to spice things up in the AFC West? Is it going to make a big difference in the draft? Y'all let me know y'all opinions, man. That's what I want, man. I bring good topics for just for opinions and advice. I just want y'all opinions, man. I do this for y'all. This ain't for me. I do this for y'all. So y'all can like communicate with each other. Like like feel the vibe. Like the excitement. The intensity. So y'all let me know, man. How y'all feel? Do y'all think Joe Flacco can actually make a change in Denver? Cause me, I basically think it's gonna depend on who they surround Joe Flacco? Who who do, who they um surround him around? Who like who gonna surround him? Like who gonna be his target? Who gonna be his offensive line? Who gonna protect him? Like stuff like that. It's a lot of it's a lot of stuff that go with the game of football. So y'all let me know in the comment section.